So what was your first concert? My concert was my own concert, I think. Really? <laughs> when I, well, yeah, when I was a young girl and I, I took vocal lessons. Yeah. And eventually I had, a, I had to perform in, uh, in front of the audience. I was, I don't know, maybe eight or something. So if you mean like a, maybe a metal band, I was not really a good visitor because my mom wouldn't let me go anywhere, you know? Oh. And due to the fact that all the huge bands, they used to come to, to the capital of Ukraine which is Kiev, and I was born and I spent all my like uh, childhood and teenage years in Donetsk or like in Donetsk region. So it's a completely different side of, yeah. the, yeah. of the country. So I needed, I needed money to travel and my mom was just like, no, fuck no. So I spent all my like young years just watching local bands and local uh, venues sort of yeah that's it but my first big like big worldwide like known band was uh, soulfly in two 2003 i think yeah i think we talked about this last time or one of the interviews yeah. we did you, you mentioned that you went and then your your boyfriend at the time got into a fight yeah and you guys had to leave or something like that yeah so <laughs> i watched only 30 minutes <laughs> and i told you before that's enough for me to get bored. <laughs> so it's not a problem. I wish the guys from Soulfly won't get mad at me <laughs> or not, not, won't get offended. <laughs> well, okay, so what do you think is, you've obviously, I'm going to assume you've been to many more shows. You obviously, Ginger has played so many festivals all over <laughs> where there are other bands playing. Um, so what's the best live show you've ever seen? Like the performance where you're like, okay, this makes me, I like this. Maybe... Once I saw Evanescence, also I, when we toured with Arch Enemy, I really liked their performance. I like it. I didn't, even if I didn't like the music of, uh, first, they made me like it <laughs> <laughs> after the whole tour because, oh, yeah, that was amazing. All the lights and uh, yeah, everything. And uh, Mishuga, Mishuga, I liked yeah. them. Yeah, even if it was like, it, it was still, uh, I didn't like the, their music either, but uh, when I saw them live, yeah, I was just, dude, it's, it's such a difficult music to, to perceive, right? Yes, absolutely. But, but due to the live performance and light, like stage light and everything, I don't know why, it, the sound engineer presented it it's such a mild way so it it penetrated my brain you know it's like dude it's easy to to listen to them while you're watching them yeah but not when you're just like in, the, in your headphones or whatever yeah so, yeah, yeah. When, so when you started touring um with ginger I'm, I'm, I'm you guys kind of had to play smaller places and travel around and maybe would you have to like find places to stay like with fans and stuff like that? Would you like crash on people's floors? Yeah. 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 What, it was what's exactly the, like that. Yeah. What's we, the worst we, experience you ever had with that? Like what's the worst place you ever uh, had to stay? Yeah. So, oh, well, don't get me wrong. So the, the p people were really <laughs> kind to us, you know, and yeah. I really appreciate for all the attention and the kindness and the, um, hospitality but sometimes i remember that was um hungary i think it was hungary or some european country we were there for the first time and um, the owner of the venue he came to us and said like okay you guys you are staying tonight in our like complex <laughs> so let me show you your uh, room where you are going to stay so we followed him and he showed us like a room with maybe some couches and the floor. And we said, oh, all right, just give us some, some mattresses. Maybe so we can use it. He said, yeah, sure. And so we played with along, alongside uh, another band from Russia. 
and this dude, the owner, showed them the same room. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you guys. There were 15 of us or something in the same room. Yeah. It was kind of confusing, but then we stole some beers from, from his from his uh, fridge. I said uh-huh. to the to the camera, you know, sorry, <laughs> sorry, but we are leaving <laughs> with your beer. Yeah. A lot of a lot of weird weird things. It, it, it's gonna be a long, long, long interview. <laughs> well, I'd okay, rather so- I'd rather tell you those stories like outside of the Okay. In- okay. Well, I know, so I remember when I, the first time we met, um, it was here in Los Angeles. You were playing mm-hmm. the whiskey, I think it was. Yeah, and yeah. We did, we did the interview on your tour bus. And you, I think, if I'm remembering this right, you had some gifts that, that fans had brought for you. Some, they brought you some Probably, things. Probably, yeah. Yeah, I can't remember what they are, but uh, what's, what's like the craziest gift you've ever got from a fan? That was this, uh, this on this tour. We had everyone, each of us had a present from a girl. I think it was like handmade jewelry. So it was like a leather or something like a stri- st- strip yeah. with a bone, with a bone. And everyone decided that that was a finger bone. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what was that, but that was like she said, it's a real bone. <laughs> so it, it was kind of creepy. No one wanted to, to have it. So they <laughs> gave it, they gave it away to me. You know? <laughs> so I kept them. Yeah. You have all, you have all the bones. Yep. What did you do with them? I don't remember. I remember that I gave it to another person. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, this person was like, wow, can I have it? Yep. yep sure. Sure. Enjoy. Did you did you ever find out like what kind of bones they really were? No, 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 no. I no. tried to, to spare spare me the details. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so we can get, we just assume that they were real finger bones, like human finger bones. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm yeah. not sure, but they were like my friends were completely positive that that was they were human bones. Like, Come on. <laughs> All right, so here's here's our last question for you, and then you're you're a free woman on on to the yeah. next on to the next uh, interview. Um, yeah, sure. Okay, so if you if you if you I know you Ginger would probably never do this, but if you were to do this, if you were going to come on stage where the band goes on, and then you come on afterwards, like the band's already there, you have like a personal entrance song mm-hmm. that gets played over the venue PA what would be your personal entrance song? Like, you know, you like, you walk in, like you're a fighter going into yeah, the ring yeah, or whatever, yeah, you know, yeah. what would be, what would be your song? Ooh. I think that since I love my nickname that I created <laughs> for myself, you know, um, you know, this song, um, L.E.G., you know, the, 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 the artist, L.E.G., L.A.R.A.L.I., and G letter. Oh, I only uh, know I only know Ali G from um uh you know Sasha Cohen does Ali G, his character. I don't know the artist yeah. Ali G though. Well there's a song Buyaka Buyaka <laughs> <laughs> Buyaka that's called Buyaka. And yeah it because it, it, it it's you you can check it out uh, yeah. on like YouTube. It, it's 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 a really like fun fun song and uh, kind of like cheerful and jolly so and it's kind of like it, it gives you um, a, like dance hall vibes yeah you know, it, it's very dancey so yeah that's so I think funny that because Ali, cool. Ali G the character the Sasha Baron Court the Sasha Baron Court he says Booyaka, Booyaka Shah he says that all the time yeah well maybe we're talking about the same person yeah yeah, you re- you know the 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 movie called Borat. Yeah, same Borat. guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah Sa- that's Sasha him. Cohen. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, we're talking about the same guy. I didn't know. I didn't know yeah. there was a song. That's what it is. Okay, I didn't know yeah. he had a song. Oh, okay, yeah, definitely the same guy. Then that's awesome. Um, yeah. <laughs> Tati, thank you so much for your time. Thank you for doing this. Oh, 
that no problem no problem now i'm gonna enjoy my evening and maybe just like sleep because it's fucking it's been raining for like for a week already oh wow so i'm always i'm always like sleepy and yeah get some yeah. rest i am but i it, it <laughs> seems like it's never enough <laughs> yeah i know the feeling i know the feeling yeah 